from all walks of life across the African continent under one roof in hopes of finding long-term solutions to challenges women face. The second edition of the African Women in Dialogue will focus on how women can be agents of change in achieving peace and security and alleviating poverty in Africa. Some of our countries still face deadly conflict which takes the lives of innocents and results in the displacement of civilian populations, mostly women and children, as we, so, we know. Especially noteworthy is that these conflicts are often started by men who are too old to do the fighting themselves, and in most cases, too secure to be personally affected by this conflict. For us, this underscores the need to pose difficult but necessary questions about, one, the formulation and practical implementation of policies for peace, governance frameworks that support and promote peace, economic development, and greater social justice, with Africa's resources at the center of the achievement of these goals. The event is supported by the United Nations Women. We are calling for civil society to work together with government, but to lead a process, if I may emphasize, that must galvanize even a faster pace towards gender equality. Kenyan woman activist editor Ochieng is a survivor of sexual abuse. Her ordeal has strengthened her conviction in the need to fight against gender-based violence. As a sexual and gender-based survivor, it has been long. When I was six years old, I was defiled. At the 16 years old, again, uh, facing gang rape, it, has been, it was difficult in my life. And at, at some point, my dreams were shattered. And then I realized it has been happening to women, but these women were silent. For me, I couldn't be silent. The only way I believed is uh, through sharing our stories and talking to each other and then we found a solution just building a, a stable movement coming together and we decided we're going to fight sexual and gender based violence in Kibera. The week long dialogue is expected to broaden and inspire the vision of African women under a common development agenda. Natasha Piri, SABC News, Ekurulen.